class of 2020, congratulations on your big day. Many of you got your start at the fabulous Reinhardt Elementary. We are so proud of you. We can't wait to see what your futures hold. Congratulations. Congratulations, Quest graduating class of 2020. It's Mr. Steinberger from Utley Middle School wishing you the best of luck. Hi there, I'm Rockwall County Judge David Sweet. On behalf of all of us at Rockwall County, congratulations to the 2020 graduating class of the Rockwall Quest Academy. I'm Dwayne Kane, and this is Leslie Johnson. And to the graduates of 2020, we're proud of you. I pray that you'll have many more accomplishments in your lifetime, and I guarantee that if you'll set goals, work hard, you'll experience many successes. Hi, my name is Corky Randolph. I'm the market president for Alliance Bank here in Rockwall. Alliance Bank and all of its employees wish to congratulate all of the graduates for 2020 for the Quest Academy. I'm sure you guys are glad to be done and we couldn't be more proud. Hey Quest graduates, it's your state representative Justin Holland. I just wanted to say congratulations and I wish you the very best in the next season of your life. God bless Texas. Congratulations seniors. The Jones Jaguars are so proud of you. Hello, I'm Barbara Jackson. My husband, Steve, and I own Toyota of Rockwall. It is a privilege and an honor for me to address the 2020 graduating class at Rockwall ISD. As you receive your diploma, I send you with this. Go confidently in the directions of your dreams. Congratulations. Hey, Quest Academy graduates and former Williams Wildcats. The Williams faculty wants you to know that we're very proud of you and congratulations on your big accomplishment. Good evening and welcome to the Rockwall Quest Academy class of 2020 graduation. And welcome to our live stream viewers watching on Facebook Live. Thank you for joining us. My name is Christina Bradford, principal of Rockwall Quest Academy. It is my honor to join you tonight on this momentous occasion. Before we begin our ceremony tonight, let us honor our guests. Let us honor our great nation. Will you please stand with me? Gentlemen, please remove your caps as we play our national anthem. You may be seated. The class of 2020, the Rockwell ISD staff and the Board of Trustees appreciate your attendance at this culminating event and the apex of each graduate's public school education. I am amazed by the many accomplishments and, and impressed with the resilience of our students. There is no doubt in my mind that these students seated here will leave Rockwell ISD and be part of amazing things to come. That's what I expect. At this time, it is a pleasure to introduce our special guest this evening. Guests, please stand when I call your name. First, our Board of Trustees, Mr. John Bailey. <laughs> Trustee Stephanie Adams. <laughs> Trustee Lee Pleggins.
Also joining us is Rockwell ISD Superintendent of Schools, Dr. John J.J. Bilreal. From the Rockwell ISD leadership team, Chief Academic Officer for Secondary Schools, Dr. Amy Anderson. Senior Chief Financial Officer, Mr. David Carter. And Chief Communications Officer, Ms. Renee Murphy. I would also like to take a moment and recognize Todd Bradford, Principal of Rockwell Heath High School. <laughs> and Camp Kevin Samples, Principal of Rockwall High School. And any other principals and staff members from all of the Rockwell ISD schools, thank you for coming. All of you have played a role in getting these graduates to this day. Could you please stand and be recognized? Audience, let's thank them. <laughs> Lastly, I would like to recognize the incredible staff from Rockwall Crest Academy. Come on, Christina. Parents, I want you to know that these teachers are the very best. In addition, I would like to give a special thanks to everyone who has helped plan this graduation. Thank you. Now for our keynote speaker. Our superintendent, Dr. John Villarreal, has served as the superintendent of Rockwell ISD since 2016. He exemplifies the district core values of relationships, innovation, and excellence in everything he does. During this pandemic and emergency school closure, he, along with the Board of Trustees and our district cabinet, have guided us to continue offering excellence through a new platform of online campus learning while taking care of students by providing grab-and-go meals. And most importantly, he cares about our staff and students. Thank you, Dr. V. <laughs> Audience, at this time, please help me Give a huge welcome to our superintendent, Dr. Villarreal. Thank you, Ms. Bradford. Isn't she great? Everybody give Ms. Bradford a round of applause. I know you're excited to see her like I am. All right, so thank you to the extraordinary class of 2020. Thank you, teachers. Thank you, parents. You know, recently, for all of us, the things that we planned and loved in this life, maybe, that, maybe things that we took for granted suddenly stopped, right? The last 11 weeks has been challenging, has been unsettling, and not just because of the COVID-19 crisis and all the news there within, but, but if we're honest, it's because more is because None of us really knows what we're doing during a COVID crisis emergency. But here's, here's what I've learned in this. Here's what I do know. All of you, all of our administrators, all of our community, our community leaders, and all of our parents have done the best that they could during this time. And we trust to know that there's a unique plan for each graduate in the class of 2020, no matter what the circumstance is. You know, NOAA crisis was not what all of us expected or planned. The new experience of self-quarantine is not something we expected either. But during self-quarantine, I watched so many of you miss one another and you were excited to see each other and you demonstrated that we need each other by appreciating our core values of relationships. It's those positive relationships that we're all encouraged by. And the positive relationships with one another, the positive relationships with our families, our administrators, our teachers, all have helped, we've helped one another during this difficult time. Now, I trust many of you miss one another and I can't see body language, but I trust that that's the case. You know, we're all Rockwall ISD and positive relationships are the foundation for our learning. So I wanna thank the parents. I wanna thank the students. And again, parents, thank you for being the best substitute teachers possible. 
You know, at first glance, yes, it feels like you missed out on 11 weeks of school. Still, this crisis has hopefully provided you an opportunity to experience what no other class before you has experienced. And that's perseverance at a whole nother level. That's hope at a whole nother level. And that's a love for one another at a whole nother level. The class of 2020 will stand out for the rest of our lives for experiencing an undiscovered and wonderful path that each and every one of you have had a chance to experience. And it might be years before you realize just how unique you are. You know, as we celebrate your completion of crossing the finish line as a high school graduate, know that your race has just started. Yes, things feel uncertain. But thankfully, being a graduate of Rockwell ISD in this great community, and with the assistance of a special group of teachers, you are prepared for excellence and will push forward to achieve excellence like no other graduating class before you. I mean that. Good luck. God bless you. We love you. Thank you, Dr. V, for your remarks this evening. We appreciate those words of encouragement. Now, for our scholarship presentation. We have four scholarships to be awarded tonight. Students, if I announce your name, please place your mask back on and come forward to the lower stage to receive your scholarship certificate. We will begin with the Rock Scholarship. Rock is the district's after school program that operates between 3 and 6 p.m. The mission of Rock is to provide a secure, enriching, and positive learning environment for, early, for elementary age children. Many Quest Academy students volunteer to help the Rock program with, it, with administrative duties throughout the year. The Rockwall Quest Scholarship awards deserving students who display leadership, character, and plans to continue their education. This year, the Rock Quest Scholarship in the amount of $500 will be awarded to J-Rod Kalio. Congratulations, J-Rod. It doesn't matter. <laughs> we have another Rock Scholarship in the amount of $500 that is awarded to Lori Lopez. Congratulations, Lori. You got it. The next scholarship will be the Shannon Scholarship. Stan Shannon, a former teacher at Quest Academy, made many contributions to the lives of young people through his work as an educator and coach. The purpose of this scholarship is to let his work continue to enrich the lives of young people for years to come. This year, the Shannon Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Lovey Tespe. Congratulations, Levy.
The next scholarship is the New Beginning Scholarship. This scholarship is in honor of Brett Martin, who lost his life in an accident. His parents, James and Diane Martin, were both educators in our district. Each year, as a memorial, Brett, this family awards the New Beginning Scholarship to a deserving student who plans to continue their education. This year, the New Beginning Scholarship in the amount of $500 is awarded to Tara Kellis. <laughs> Congratulations, Tara. Mm -hmm. I am proud of you. I am proud of you. I am so proud of each and every one of you. I'm talking to you. <laughs> you made it. You wanted to become 18 just in order to be an adult so that you wouldn't have to ask anybody else for permission. Well, congratulations. You no longer have to ask life for permission. I want you to walk out of here today and stand proud with your head held high because you have accomplished graduating from a district that is the best, the very best, in the state of Texas, a district who believes in relationships, innovation, and excellence, Rockwall ISD. It's time for you to write your own story. And as my kids, I always call you guys my kids, as my kids, I am compelled to share one thing with you before you leave. As you go through this journey of life, life is going to challenge you. And there will come a time when you will struggle. So when that time comes for you to struggle, you don't have to freak out because you've already been forewarned that there will be a struggle. It may be a bad day. It could be a night where you're all alone with just you and your thoughts and you're down and you think you can't do it or someone has doubted you. Or if you're like me, when you go through a struggle like that, you may feel like a failure or that people have counted you out. But I'm here to tell you, it is in those moments of struggle that you should look for opportunity in failure. Did you hear me? You should look for opportunity in failure. Figure out what you did wrong and rise above that struggle. Find opportunity in failure. Now, you guys love raps and, and bars or whatever you call it and jingles or whatever. So I have a little something for you. Just a little. <laughs> All right. While you're out there Snapchatting, because everybody can't, has to live with Snapchat these days, Dr. V. You know, they have to have Snapchat, right? Everybody has to have Snapchat. While you're out there Snapchatting and TikToking, don't forget opportunity still knocking. Step up to the plate. You decide your fate. And when you're out there among the rest, Quest, I want you to walk different. I want you to talk different because you have come from the very best. Now is the time that you have all been waiting for. It's that time. Would you please rise? Dr. Villarreal, would you please join me at the podium? As principal of Quest Academy, I certify that the students who will be receiving diplomas this evening have successfully completed the prescribed courses set for the Rockwell ISD Board of Trustees. 
the State of Texas, and the Texas Education Agency. I recommend that these students receive their high school diplomas. Thank you, Ms. Bradford. By the authority vested in me by the State of Texas on behalf of the Rockwell ISD Board of Trustees and your principal, Ms. Christina Bradford, who, certif who certifies that you have met all the requirements for high school graduation for the State of Texas, it is with honor that I declare you graduates of Rockwell ISD and Quest Academy. Ms. Bradford, Board of Trustees, and I are ready to receive your graduates. Please present the graduates at this time to receive their diplomas. Graduating class of 2020, please prepare to receive your diplomas on the lower stage. Board of Trustees, please come forward on the stage to stand in the pit. Spencer Robertson. <laughs> Natasha Babineau. You can take your mask. Xavier Black. <laughs> Paige Box. Either way. Trevante Burns. <laughs> Gerardo Carrillo. Christian Comer. <laughs> Owen Crutcher. Mark Curry. <laughs> Andrew Davis. Maggie DeFranco. Charlie Dreckage. J.C. Dupree. <laughs> Carla Esparza.
Devin Estrada. Kyla Frederick, Slade Garland, <clears throat> Emily Gill, Roland Glickia. Cassandra Goff. Brent Goucher. Elizabeth Griffin. Brendan Guancil. Damaris Gutierrez. Cameron Hargis. Benjamin Howry. Madison Henson, Pearson Holloman. You can take it off. Chandler Hauser. Diane Hunt, Zane Irby, Ethan Jernigan. <laughs> Sine Johnson. William Lake Johnson, Joseph Kaysen, J. Rod Kalio, Tara Kills. Jackie Kongbon. Gabriella Landreth. Gregory Langham. Julian Larkin. 
George Lewis. Lori Lopez. Julio Martinez. Morgan McCrary. Angela McManus. Janil Minjamar Pacheco. Ronaldo Molina. Stephen Mooney, Anna Monica, Kyle Neustockel, Michael Norwood, Javier Ortiz. Gabriela Padilla, Anai Partida. Zachary Perkins. Jasmine Rivera. Sorry, Jasmine Ramirez. My bad. Marissa Ramirez, Andres Ramon, <laughs> Alma Regal Echiandia, Guadalupe Rosas. Blake Sins, Adrian Silva, Heather Smedley. Hunter Spradlin. Jennifer Stovall. Robert Paul Strom. Anthony Tate.
Magdalena Temple. Hassan Tesfaye. Oh. Levy Tesfaye. Hassan Tesfaye. Mason Thompson, Clara Trowbridge, Kobe Trowbridge, Takiron Turner, Andrew Vanling, Eileen Velez Mejia, Alexis Vallejas, Delilah Wagner. Zion Wallace. Mason Warner. Charles Washington. And Cassidy Weatherford. We will wait for our last graduate. Class of 2020, please rise once more and move your tassels from right to left. <laughs> audience, audience, it is my honor to present the Rockwall Quest Academy graduates, class of 2020. Pick up your caps, J Rod. After you pick up your cap, <laughs> parents, this is your opportunity to see them walk out. Please remain in your seats. 
The graduates will have a parade in front of you. Pomp and circumstance. <laughs>